couple of days ago, Samini granted an interview with Belamundi whereby he expressed his displeasure over an issue he has with Sarkodie. According to him, Sarkodie has been ignoring him ever since he sent him um, a message that he wants him to be on his album or let me say his EP. But Sarkodie ignored him on Money Blue Text, yes. And Samini, according to him, hasn't been happy with it. Because when Sarkodie contacted him for a verse on the Love Rock, yeah, the famous Love Rock music, which was released eight years ago, Samini didn't hesitate. He just dropped his verse and then, I mean, went to Sarkodie, they shoot a video, and it's one of the best songs ever from the two S in the industry. But Sarko, Samini, Samini, sorry, during the Belamundi interview, or say he's not happy with Sarkodie, whatever he did. And according to him, he needs an apology from Sarkodie. Yeah, he doesn't want anything. He's very cool with him, but he still hurts. That. So this interview happened somewhere around last week. And you could see from Samini's um, demeanor and everything that he wasn't happy with what Sarkodie did. Now... In news written as yesterday indicated that Sarkodie has either replied or it's indirectly trolling Samini where he posted on his Insta stories, he posted a video of him singing the love rock, a snippet whereby it was like an apology where it was like whatever, 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 I'll put the video there but according to people, this video, he was, he was trolling Samini and it wasn't a reply. And Sarkodie, according to some people, is known for doing this. Yes, he writes on the fame of people. Just look at what happened to Black Sheriff, the countryside. I mean, when you're, when you're an artist, where you are reigning at that moment, that is when Sarkodie wants to do a song with you. This, this is no news. This is something that has been dead. This is how he stays relevant. Sarkodie, this is how Sarkodie stays relevant. And I'm surprised people don't even know about this. This is what he does. When Mr. Drew was, I mean, was all over the place. Yeah, that was when he decided to collaborate with him to release the JJ. And then when Black Sheriff was making news in Nigeria and wherever, that was when he decided to make a song with him about the countryside. This is how Sarkodie stays relevant. I mean, there's no, I wouldn't say hit song, but it's just one one hit song of Sarkodie that has been hitting. But the rest, you could see, is either a collaboration with an, an artist that is draining at that point. Yes, most of his songs that are hit is about an artist that is draining at that point. So, Samin is any, yeah, and he needs an apology. If he meets Sarkodie one on one and he doesn't apologize, he's okay. If he shakes him, he will shake him back. But he needs an apology from Sarkodie for him to be okay. And I think he's right. He needs it because you can't just call me, I help you, and then when it's my turn for you to help me, you don't mind me or you give me blue text. Such arrogance. Like, yeah, such arrogance. I mean, that's why Shatawale doesn't really like him. And I understand Shata for that. But sometimes he's loud about his things. But we, we have to agree that Shatawale is sometimes right. And Sarkodie is is very arrogant. Like I wouldn't I wouldn't say uh, uh, sometimes, but he's very arrogant when it comes to s some things. I mean, it is a legend asking you for a collaboration. If it was an international artist, this guy wouldn't even think twice to hop on it. But just because it is Asamini asking you for a verse on his album.